My name is Hunter Sheridan, I'm from Ajax, Ontario, and I was nominated this year for the Best Songwriter category, and thank you so much to the Oshawa Music Awards for the nomination. The music I write is within the folk, singer-songwriter, indie rock uh, genres, and it's really sort of hard to quantify it all in one space, but that's kind of why I started my own project under my own name, is to have freedom to sort of slide between genres, and my latest release uh, called Northern Lights is something that's a little bit more up the pop and EDM side, but a mix of singer-songwriter in there as well. So. Check out my music online, I got a lot of new stuff coming out and it's sort of a blend of a bunch of different genres all, in, all into one. It's really cool to be nominated under the category of Songwriter of the Year. Um, I'm always trying to find ways to write music that's you know, honest to the things that I'm going through or something that's relatable that I can connect what I'm feeling with what somebody else might be going through. So that's what I spend a lot of my time when I'm writing lyrics to a song or, or a progression. I, I just want it to be relatable. So it's cool to kind of be recognized for that and I really appreciate the Oshawa Music Awards for having nominated me three years in a row under this category. So thank you so much. I love writing music and it's, and it's really cool to be recognized for that in the community so thank you I think my biggest piece of advice for local songwriters and, and bands and, and artists would be to just get in the loop of what's going on uh, in, the, in the in the local scene and just sort of getting your name out there and establishing yourself with connections through booking agents and managers or record labels there's a lot of really really great companies and booking agents and stuff around uh, Toronto and Ontario so I think that there's no shortage of opportunity in the province and I think that a big part of it is just collaborating with each other and making those connections. One of my favorite memories of playing in the Durham region uh, was at the Mustache Club in Oshawa when we first opened for the Strumbellas. It was a band that I was playing with called West Hammock back in around 2018 and the Mustache Club was so kind to let us grow as a um, as a band in that space and one of the first big shows that we played there was opening for the Strumbellas who have gone on to do a lot of very cool things and I was aware of their music early on so it was really awesome to get the chance to kind of spread our wings and, and play a live show with a band that we looked up to. A couple of my number one songs, um, the, one of the ones that I've written, uh, Without a Sound, is one of my favorite songs that I've written. Uh, I really like the progression of the music and how the arrangement sort of builds and really highlights the lyrics that go through the song and there's some cool play on words in there and, and double meanings in a lot of the lyrics. So, that's one of my favorite songs that I've written, but my number one song to listen to, I guess at the moment, I would have to give it to a band called Harbor and their song called Can't Repeat It. Um, that's just one of those, it's really jammy and really fun song. So sometimes there's bands that you listen to and you want to write music like them or they just inspire you for a mood. And right now Harbor is, uh, is a band that's definitely inspiring some fun uh, music for me. To the Oshawa Music Awards for nominating me again in the Songwriter of the Year category. It does truly mean a lot to have your support, and it, I, I'm very grateful for it. So thank you very much. I will see you on September 29th at the Biltmore Theater for the awards ceremony. And congratulations to all of the nominees and to the awards ceremony. And thank you to everybody for voting and for watching. Right at me.